And you know, during the Catholic Marketing Network trade show, our own Bonnie Rogers caught up with Stephanie Engelman. And this is really appropriate because October is the month of the Holy Rosary. And Stephanie is the author of A Single Bead. I'm here with Stephanie Engelman, the author of A Single Bead. Thanks so much for being with us. Thank you, Bonnie, for having me. Our pleasure. So tell me what made you decide to write A Single Bead. Uh, this was not my choice. <laughs> I was actually looking online for another book that I had written that was a nonfiction, and I went to Pauline Books and Media's website, and I saw that they were specifically looking for Catholic young adult fiction. I'd never thought about writing fiction, but that caught my eye for some reason, and I, I laughed out loud, literally, and I said, God, if you want me to write Catholic young adult fiction, you're going to have to give me the idea, because I ain't got nothing. And you know, I kind of just left it there, but then four days later, someone sent me a tweet on Twitter. My, my handle on Twitter is a single, uh, or a few beads short. And they sent me a tweet that said, add a few beads short, but have you ever thought of the power of a single bead? I wrote back and I said, oh, that's a great idea. I'm gonna write a blog post on that. Then two hours later, we were driving home from watching a movie as a family, and the idea struck that that this was not a blog post, it was a story. God had answered my prayer, and, and I knew the, the basic um, beginning of the novel. I, I, I had it in that instant. And then God just gave me the rest. It, it, I wrote it in a month, and Pauline Books and Media ended up being the very people that in, inspired the idea, uh, ended up being the publisher. I thought, you know, what a great way to reach out to young people who aren't praying the rosary, maybe. You know, hopefully kids who read the rosary will read this, but, but kids who don't pray the rosary and who don't really have a very strong faith are much more likely to pick up a fiction novel than they are to pick up a nonfiction, you know, about the rosary. So this is a great way through fiction to get kids involved in the story, drag, you know, pull them in in that first chapter, and then they finish the story, and at the end of the story, they're like, wow, I, I didn't know I had a blessed mother in heaven that, that loves me and that's looking out for me. I didn't know that, that I could pray the rosary and it would make me feel more peaceful. And so I think it's a, it's a really, this, the whole fiction Catholic genre is a beautiful way to reach our young people. Thanks so much for being with us. Where can people get a copy of this? They can get it at pauline.org. Uh, they can also get it at their local Catholic bookshop. And uh, of course on, on the Giants uh, websites as well. Thanks so much for being with us, Stephanie. I'm glad we had this chance to talk about a single beat.